How do folk? Bro. How do folks treat you out there though? Just being out there, cook up out there on stage. How they treat cook up? Guess what, man? And I always want to tell a motherfucker this, man. Cause people be misunderstanding this shit, man. Like, like, nigga, I done been on the stage where a nigga, it's all white people out there, red niggas, bro. They probably ain't listening to no rap music, nigga. And I get up there talking about nigga. It's Donald Trap, you fucking bitch. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna make the trap great Work again, again and to, to make them like it. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Or do you don't like what I'm saying? Cause I get up there, bro, I'm gonna treat them like I do any other motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Look here, you don't like my shit, nigga. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> If you are live, subscribe. As I always say, if you are live, subscribe. Look, press that subscribe button, it's free. You know, everybody always asks, P, how do I subscribe to your channel? Press that su subscribe button. If you like this video, press the like button and give me a comment because I talk back. I got a, I got a special guest today. Y'all been telling me to get him on the show. Y'all been tagging him in my videos. Y'all been going on Facebook talking about get this certain person on the show. I got him on the show now. So look, man, if you got any questions for this man, put it in the comments. Let us know what you talking about. Man, look, shout out to my little cousin Lois. This is what I respect. Like, I'm just like really a respectful type of guy. Like, and this is what I respect about my little cousin Lois. The niggas stay neutral. <laughs> the the niggas stay fucking neutral. Uh, everyone, when we was young, I never forget, we were about five or six. The nigga was, came to my birthday party and he threw one of my shoes and lost and lost my shoes, cook up. Lost my shoes. I'm telling my mama, mama, I don't ever want him to come back to my birthday party again. But I say I'll let to say, man, my nigga always been neutral. And I feel like that's how you like can kind of move around. Like, you know what I'm saying? You can't really get your money just being, you know, you're gonna have your people that you're solid with. But uh, I'm telling you, stay neutral. But we got a special guest today. Cook up boss. What's good, homie? What's going on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <What's... laughs> cook up, what's this what I wanna on, know. Baby? I wanna ask you something. What's up? What makes cook up happy? Oh man. What makes cook up happy? Man, taking care of my people, man, and making sure I can take care of my kids and shit, bro. You know what I mean? All the rest of this shit ain't nothing to me, homie. All the rest of this shit. Yeah, yeah. Question, and I heard somebody ask you this question before, but I want to ask you again. Um, how was Cook Up upbringing? Rich, poor, um, or middle class? Man, we were poor in the <laughs> motherfucker, man. What the hell you talking about, nigga? We <laughs> laying strategic on the mattress in the living room, mm. nigga. Ain't no furniture in there. You gotta smell the feet tonight. What the hell? So yeah. what 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 like, you know, with, with with our upbringing and we know how it go, like how do you think that like, that that kind of like guided you through up until now? Oh yeah, that shit made me goddamn it. Hey, hey, I don't want to go back to that. <laughs> I don't ever want to go back to that. Yeah, but that's all I can do. Yeah, we. Even though I know, like, cook up like rap ain't your first love. I'm the first. I'm the first guy that was introducing people to your music. If you don't remember, the f look, first time Buck ever heard your music, I introduced him to it. First time Cashville Ace ever heard your music. I introduced them to it. So I'm talking about cook up. Like I always just kind of looked up to your music. Like you, I know you ain't never really took it serious. When you going when, when you gonna take rap like 10 toes, just really give it, give it that big shot that you know cook up can. Never be. <laughs> Why you say that, Cook Up? Listen, like I'm 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 coming from the I'm coming from the CEO seat. I had to step down and be a rapper because niggas lazy. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? My whole thing, I'm hustling, homie. Like, like anybody who rapping, I don't give a fuck if you Drake or you just started in your basement. You know what I mean? Like, like, you just gotta use that shit as a stepping stone, homie. Like, but then, like. But even playing the CEO part, like where you come from, you started rap first. Like, yeah. how do you guide your your artists? to do it if you ain't going hard as it as you can. 
Nah, P, look, to be honest, man, guess what? My first CD, man, remember back then, my first CD was called Spin Something With, with me. me. Most definitely. Yeah. <laughs> most, most, a, we most, was talking to motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> the fake rappers and shit, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? That was my whole thing. So I just used what I knew to, you know, uh, the the... It's hustling. The shit worked out. It was working, ain't it? That's why we came over with mm -hmm. that. This shit working. And, man, the whole time, it was just, I think, just being consistent, man. Like, it, it, I never was no rapper, though. I ain't bullshit. I used to be in there. Uh, but you can rap. Yeah, yeah. Any nigga with a story can rap. For real. Nowadays. Not really. I mean. I'm talking about really can do this shit, though. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That's yeah, what done, I'm talking about. I done, I done had a few, I done had a few, you know what I mean, knew a few laps around the uh, uh, place now, so, you know. I, I, Look, they, they talked about cook-up. I was on vacation, and they talked about cook-up. to cook-up on the road with that white boy, this and that, this and that. And and, they, and Jelly, shout out to Jelly Roll. Yeah. I said, cook-up doing the right thing. Cook-up on the road with the people trying to get the real fans. Exactly. And so, cook-up, how you get that relationship with, like, Jelly Roll and being able to have that opportunity? Because anybody would have took it. I've been knowing Jelly bro, since we was in juvenile. Like, you know, they ain't, they probably ain't been, I've been knowing Jelly, me personally, like, Jelly been my homie, like, Thanks. know him, know him, since we was going to juvenile and shit together and shit. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So how you get to, like, go on the road with him, though? Like, did Jelly invite you or did yeah, you have to? Yeah, he invited me. He kept it, Jelly always kept it 100 with me, man. I, 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 don't, I don't have nothing ill. Nothing bad or nothing. How was it on the road though, with you being a rap artist and he doing country? You know what I'm saying? Like how at was the it? time Jelly really wasn't he wasn't doing country. Okay, well he, like he was doing, you know, he was like he was like crossing over into that. You know, he had okay. the singing songs and the and the, you know, he, he always got the, the the you know, the drug abuse songs and yeah. shit like that, you know. And, you know, he was doing that, and then he he sprinkled a little rap in there. You see what I'm saying? I was just opening for him shit. I love the jelly, goddamn it, man. Hey, you make money with jelly, how them folk, How them folks treat you out there, though? Just being out there, cook up out there on stage. How they treat cook up? Guess what, man? And I always want to tell a motherfucker this, man. Because people be misunderstanding this shit, man. Like, like, nigga, I done been on the stage where a nigga... It's all white people out there, rednecks, bro. They probably ain't listening to no rap music, nigga. And I get up there talking about, nigga, it's Donald Trap, you fucking bitch. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make the trap great Work again, again. and to, to make them like it. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Or do you something like what I'm saying? Because I get up there, bro, I'm going to treat them like I do any other motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Look here, you don't like my shit, nigga. <laughs> Fuck you. It'll turn into a burning session, <laughs> nigga. That's why you don't got no teeth. Yeah, you ain't buy my motherfucking shirt. Yeah, I, I get on the stage. Yeah, like that too. man, fuck them people. You know what I mean? You got to be you yeah. at the same time, bro. Like, these niggas got to understand that if you ain't you, then shit. Then, but how did you? What you take on road with? Do you do you sell merch and all that stuff out there? How you? How did man, that listen, work? Listen, man, listen, listen, P. Man, fuck the music. Mm. Man, I made so much money off my merch, man. Look, you go one of them smart dummy, man. That's what I try to tell them. I'm a smart, smart dummy. dummy. <laughs> That's what they get. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? But. Man, I made so much off the merch, man. This is just, just okay. Then I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna add this up like his right uh -huh. here. The CD cost five dollars. The hat cost forty five. Mm. <laughs> Which one you rather sell? Okay, then. Give me, give me, <laughs> give me the hat. Sell the hat. Okay, then. <laughs> sell the hat. I'm just, I'll, I'll be trying to get motherfuckers to understand that. You see what I'm saying? So what y'all like playing in when, when you was on roll with Jeff uh, 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 with Jelly Roll rolling or catching the plane? Like, what? oh no, nah, you know we on the, we on the roll. You know we uh, shit. I, we did. We did about 50 shows. We did damn near Ooh. show in the state. Ooh. Like Jelly moving around, bro. Man, Jelly moving around good. Shout out to Jelly. And Shout so, out to Jelly. In your, in your mental mindset, Cook Up, like you was once the nigga. And I'm talking about in rap. Everybody, Cook Up, Cook Up, Cook Up. What could Nashville could have done better for you to get behind you a little more? What you think? 
Or do you think they were behind you enough? No, nah, they weren't going to never get behind no nigga like me, P. Why you think not? I'm really from here. We got too much history. I done probably did something to these people. They still don't like me for that. I probably wooed this nigga, you know what I mean? He still don't like me for that. Yeah, you know I mean? You know I mean? Probably the little gal over there. Yeah, you know what I mean? Nigga still, he don't like, you know what I mean? So they would never get behind me, but if you know, that's why I always say I never, I'm never fucked up with passing the torch yeah. or putting it in one of these little niggas hand and let them run. I, I get it. I, I move in behind them. I make mines, you know what I mean? I'm gonna get mines off the back end, you, you know what I mean? You think that came from like the street element of like yeah, yeah, then yeah, I just yeah, put, yeah. put another yeah, yeah, nigga yeah, on, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And, and, and ain't tripping. So yeah. cook up ain't gotta be the big guy in no, front. No, hell no. I, I don't want that anyway. The nigga in that limelight got them gonna turn green. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, you want that limelight? Like, that motherfucker gonna turn your ass green. You better be Incredible Hulk. Man, but that limelight, like, man, that motherfucker gonna get you, man. Yeah, man. I ain't, I ain't seen too many niggas to survive that limelight, like, man. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, and then look, cook up. I'm just, I'm just giving you your flowers while you're here. Matter of fact, look, I don't want my flowers until I'm dead, cook up, because I feel like it ain't my, my stuff ain't done until I'm dead. So. Wait till I'm done and then give me my flowers. I want to be dead first until you give me mine. Yeah, because that's fucked up here. You know, listen, motherfucker, again, you some flowers. I don't want no damn flowers, flowers. nigga. <laughs> the hell? Bring them to my grave. Exactly, man. That's like you killing me early. Give me some flowers. Your job ain't over with. Cook exactly. up ain't Why done anything that cook up can do. I mean? see, see, they got this shit so fucked up around here with. With 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 dick riding and giving flowers like yeah you know I mean all that old shit man listen I mean when did that even become a thing? No, cook up. You if you fuck with somebody, like you just said, if you fuck with somebody and you go tell this man who over here that don't know that person that man I fuck with dude man check this out that ain't dick riding man niggas got this shit really fucked up oh. man you hear what I'm saying that's that's like bigging up your people or or. Word of mouth, you see what I'm yeah, saying? Facts, like, facts. people got this shit all fucked, fucked up. up. But a, a, a nigga who really got some hate or envy in his heart going, oh, you dick riding. <laughs> and, and so, Cook Up, look, I ask, I ask uh, people this all the time. This is what I want to know. Because you a street nigga and you a rap nigga. I look at you like I put you in both I'm lanes because you I'm been there. I'm a rapper beat. Yeah, you a rap nigga. <laughs> 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 I put him in both lanes. So, Cook Up, like... What you gotta do in this rap shit for Nashville to be an OG in rap, to be a, a a Cashville legend, whatever you call it, in your opinion? What you think? What is a real Cashville legend, not just because you rap? Be who you say you is. Mm. If I can go check back and you ain't got to all the checks in your motherfucker on your motherfucking resume, whether good or bad, yeah. you see what I'm saying? You ain't got all them checks. You done got on here. You got this, this, this. You done did, did, this, 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 this. That's what the internet fuck up these niggas. You done got up there and showed your ass and and spread the money up your arm. And now they supposed to, now you got to have that every time yeah, a motherfucker see You got to have it every time. Every time. <laughs> That's just like that outfit you don't want to spend 10 grand on. No. You can't only take one picture. Once you take that one picture. You can't wear it no more. You can't wear that no more. <laughs> Yeah, you know I mean, for real, <laughs> for real, so, man. So in this rap, whatever you rapping about, if you ain't up, if you if you ain't showing that in real life, you ain't who you say you, ain't you say is. Who, you ain't who you say you is, man. In a and in a small sense, what's what you think like wrong with Nashville? Why them niggas and everybody that rap here can't get over the hump? It's the, why you it's think? The, let me let me tell you about it. Come on. This, I want you to. The, 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 the reason why they can't care, it's like the bug. It's like a bug, bro. Like they get it, they they famous too damn fast. Mm. And don't nobody know you 30 Ooh. minutes down the road, nigga. You hear me? You famous <laughs> too goddamn fast. You, you, done, Clark, you, done went to, you done went to 10 hookah bars around here. They done booked you at 10 hookah bars <laughs> and, and your song playing or something. But the, the DJ's around here and you think you got them and done made it. No, nah, homie. This shit ain't, hey. Man, that shit, you ain't got them in May. You ain't scratched the surface yet, <laughs> man. Scratched the surface. Man, this shit crazy. See, these niggas get on too fast in the head. So you got to damn near be humble with that shit. Like, you know what I mean? 
or, or keep working at it at, at, at to consistency, bro. Yeah. Be consistent. And then let me tell you something though. Come on. I'm gonna tell you this this really why no Nashville nigga ain't on. Too many people from elsewhere is in the positions to move the music. What you mean, like what? Like, 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 like. How, it's, it's, if a nigga from Atlanta down here run the radio, ain't he done promised some people from Atlanta, goddammit, that he gonna get them on? I'm probably sure he have, if okay. he from Atlanta. Okay then, if he from Memphis, ain't he done promised some niggas in Memphis? And he gonna push that shit? I'm sure he probably has. So once he get up here, what what makes him work and thinking he gonna work for some Nashville niggas? Mm. You see what I'm saying? So that means we need to get one of these Nashville niggas in that position. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And then we go from there. Fuck all the he say, she say, he done this, he done that, he didn't do this, he didn't do that. Start right there. But then but, a nigga understand what I'm saying. But you also have to have a hit song, right? The music gotta be right. Man, any song a hit, man. Long as it ain't, it ain't, people don't understand there's no such thing as a hit song, bro. Mm. It's marketed. However you market it, man, because you can get on there. Look at look at Sexy Red, bro. Yeah. Man, you can get on there with a bitch, man. They got a song called Run the Red Light or some shit they just showed me, man. What yeah. the fuck is that, man? <laughs> so if you, if you market it right, that's going to be a hit, homie. That's going to be a hit. You see what I'm saying? Ain't no such thing as you got a hit song. There's a lot of shit bumping. That shit ain't made it past goddamn the interstate up there, man. Mm. For real, that shit ain't made it past <laughs> Rivergate Mall, bro. You know what I mean? <laughs> you can't even get them to play it in these hookah bars. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Yeah. It. They'll play it when you walk in. Now, you see what I'm saying? They'll play your shit when you walk okay. in, when they see you. But if you ain't there, they ain't playing they it. They ain't playing your shit, man. But do you think it's like more of the relationships that the artists got with the DJs and stuff? No, nah, man, because the DJs think they artists and shit too now. Yeah, nigga, quit playing, nigga. Yeah, I, I ain't, I don't, I don't got no, I don't, you know, I don't got no yeah. button for no none of these niggas, I man. The DJ it. think he the artist too. Man. He wants some bitches. He wants the hoes up there with him drinking drinks and popping bottles while he's spinning the records. <laughs> yeah, man, this shit out of control, man. Listen, man, it's, 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 it's the tension needle. That's why I say, man, if you find a nigga that don't want the attention, why you think J. Cole went and so killer? Mm, why? A nigga like J. Cole, he don't want the attention. Mm. He's still cool with going in Walmart and buying him an outfit and going to get him some bitches, the bitches that was for him. They don't care if he stink, how he smell, what he look like, if he done combed his hair, he got the bitches for him. You see mm, what I'm saying? Right. I learned that going with the with the white people and shit. You see what I'm saying? They don't like him for that. They like him shit. I watch a man, a millionaire, bro, go in the store and get them them little bullshit shirts and shit and cut the arms off and show their tattoos and shit yeah. and get the baddest bitch in the world, bro. So all, all the, the trashiest bitch in the world, we would think. So, so all the hype on the clothes and the jewelry and stuff, that stuff really don't matter, don't mean nothing to it. Man, that shit don't mean nothing. Have these nigga jewelry fake, man. <laughs> Shit fake, man. <laughs> hey, this but, shit fake. But they got man. the diamond testers now. So oh, that shit ain't anything. That, you can rig the diamond tester, yeah. man. I want these niggas to know that. That's why I'm gonna put that out there. That's another gem on you. <laughs> you can rig the diamond tester. Wow. Yeah. Cause why these, these niggas, niggas running around shit? town. Yeah. Look, test it. Test all that old shit. Test my shit. Yeah, man. Fake shit. Uh, 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 <laughs> test real too. It is shout out, man. <laughs> okay, so look, but look, this cook up. This is another thing I give you props for. You one of the only niggas that have signed the deal. Yeah. And it, it ain't too many niggas in Nashville that's that has signed the deal. And I say that, I say I would, to anybody, I don't care what you say. If you signing with somebody that knows somebody that's done been somewhere, you're in a good position. So how you and Yellowwood start with y'all starting? What y'all really have going on? We had a partnership, bro. We 50 50. How you think Cook Up came out of there? Like, uh, Cook Up was wrong with them, yeah. man. It was a partnership. You know what I mean? See, people don't understand. It's, it's, you can sign deals, man. Shit be structured different ways, man. Motherfuckers be having all type of other shit going on, man. And, 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 and just really, because I didn't take no money. Yeah. I ain't need no money. You ain't got to give me no money, money. up front. I got my own studio. Yeah. I got my own van. I got my own everything. Yeah. I'm ready to go. Shit, I'm a dream come true. Shit. 
But now you got to give me my back end, though. Mm. What made you uh, sign with them, though? What made you do a partnership with him? What'd you say? Fans, bro. You need fans, bro. Well, definitely. How you going to do music without no fans? It's like selling drugs without no customers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you, you just got sell. it. Exactly. You just got the, you just got the, you just got the music. You just got the sack. Yeah, you know I mean, you ain't got, you can't sell it to nobody. Yeah, you know I mean, it's like, yeah, you know I mean, this shit, you know what I mean? In, in, in your mind, Cooker, what was your first hit that you think? Your first, what your first man? I know your first man. Rex, Rex was your first man. man Rex, bro. Rex. Listen, I didn't even know what I was doing. And shout out to Star. Star. Star, out to Star. I think Star was wooing me back then. You know, I ain't know what was going on. You know what I mean? I still love. Cause he out there real he knew, quick. He knew. He knew. He yeah. get what the nigga taught me everything yeah. though. He taught me how to uh wiggle through the you know and get my bread off of. Music shit. I ain't gonna lie. I, never, I always get that nigga that. Yeah, yeah. I what got made to. you start messing with Star real tough? Like, cause you, you know, know we fam, all love fam, Star, bro. You yeah. know, he, 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 right. He, you know, we come, we come from. You know what I mean? Same place. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He fam. You know what I mean? You know, Chino T. You know what I mean? Shit. You know, from that we've been goddamn it. You know what I mean? Cause was, I already know you that the show was another night. Yeah, 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 you know, yeah, yeah, I mean. How y'all much you think um, Slum American built up your uh, your career? Like, how you think that impacted your career? Like, what did it actually do for you outside of because you already had a push before you went to them? Fans, bro, niggas don't understand the word fan, bro. Supporters, <laughs> like yeah, you know I mean, you gotta understand the words. This the words these people throwing around you, nigga. You my nigga, people. I don't think you never bought my motherfucking CD, nigga. I probably you know. see what I'm saying. Lord, yes, my yes, goddamn I have, brother, I, I, I he ain't bought, buying I bought, my CD. I bought them. I bought a couple of your CDs. Yeah, the, the CDs. I ain't bought nothing, nothing, nothing recent. Uh, that's what I'm saying. But I done bought but, a but couple of your CDs. But what I'm saying, CD. but what I'm saying yeah. is, they gave you. <laughs> 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 but what I'm saying is they give you the understanding what it is for you to like this is a fan man this is you know what I mean this is a supporter this is a person who who they 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 y'all wouldn't never came together if you didn't have no music to get in or 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 you didn't have no product for them. You see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah. So y'all would have never seen these people. So they made me understand what the real fans and shit was, man. Like people who support you. The difference between like a motherfucker who just around asking for something or trying to get something out of you or 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 or, or just pushing for you right there in your face. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. You see what I'm saying? Like you got to, you, you need that motherfucker who gon', you know what I mean? Like, I know some motherfuckers probably, bro, that don't even know you, know a motherfucker personally, or know they are artists personally, mm -hmm. but they gonna go, it's gonna be a debate about it. Like, you see what I'm saying? Or about any situation about that specific artist, you see what yep. I'm saying? That they gonna go to the grave with it, you, you see what I'm you, saying? You think they pushed you enough, like, and you think you got what you deserved out the whole thing? Even yeah. though I know you, I don't know if you still. I know you still got love for him, but yeah, yeah, you think yeah. you you got what you deserved out of that whole situation? No, nah, no, nah. like just the demographics. It it was it was it it really like it really like uh, on some bring motherfuckers. It, it really like done what it's supposed to do for real. Like, you know what I mean? Like it's redneck motherfuckers, it's army motherfuckers, it's police motherfuckers, it's probably motherfuckers who don't like niggas, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's black folks that don't like white people. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? It's hood people, it's gang bangers, you know what I mean? It's motherfuckers who 
roll hay, you know what I mean, farmers, all that, and it's all in one. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, it brung everybody together, so you don't know who like what, bro. Like, that's, that's really what that shit taught me, because, man, I was in goddamn it, boys of Idaho, man, a motherfucker place, man, Mormons, bro, where they got the, and these motherfuckers were saying my shit word for word, bro. Wow. Fuck me up, bro. I done been in Mesa, Arizona, bro. Mm. Like some shit I ain't never been in before. Like, you know, like. Cook up in Mesa. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. like some shit like that, bro. Like it's crazy. Like crazy little towns, bro. Yeah. And, 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 it, and it, you know what I mean? So that's why I be always talking shit to niggas around here because I'm trying to get them to understand, bro, what you're doing ain't you, 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 you. you it's good to pop your shit, right? Yeah. Pop your shit. Don't let no nigga dim your light, but it's a time for that shit, man. You know what I mean? Cause, cause, cause nowadays with the internet, man, one incident, whether you thinking it's gonna get you on, that motherfucker might reverse and fuck your whole oh, shit up, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. yeah but yeah. with Cook Up done been through it, why you think they don't listen to Cook Up? Or do they listen to Cook Up? They do when they gag, okay. get out the car and shit. They okay. ride around. They getting pointers <laughs> and shit, man. You know what I mean? Niggas really- come and say my bars and shit <laughs> back to them. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Back to me. You know what I mean? The motherfucker probably listening to Well, I'm me, just you know even talking about on the business end because you done done it and make, made money at it. You know what I mean? And yeah, there's a lot of niggas P, you fuck I with. Listen, P. I, I, I listen. Hold man. On me and you, I don't think it's it probably two motherfuckers done made more money off of music than me mm. around here, nigga. That's all I can say. Like, With yeah. the merchant shit in there and everything. That's what I can tell a nigga, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, they talking their ass off. You know what I mean? And they might have not made more in profit. That's, that's what I'm trying to tell okay. you. You see what I'm saying? That one, I'm drop shipping a thousand hats. Forty-five dollars $45 a piece. <laughs> I was thirteen thousand and some of them on 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 my on my Shopify. Mm. That ain't even had nothing to do with on tour. And shit, you see what I'm saying? And that's all man, coming listen, to bro, cook up. Let's, listen, bro. I, I, we, I met dude. I met Yellow Wolf, bro. Dave Slum. I'm trapping. I made the Slum trap, bro. Put that shit on some shirts, bro. Got on the roll, bro. I sold damn near forty, fifty thousand shirts, bro. With that shit, nigga. Mm. I'm trying to tell these niggas, man. These niggas flawed, man. <laughs> I don't know what they talking about. <laughs> Yeah. Cook up gonna make money yeah. in whatever area. Man, I had a band with a trailer. I'm pulling on that motherfucker full of shirts and shit, nigga. <laughs> Hat said thing, man. I would have got some shoes made with that shit on there <laughs> if I knew a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> cook up, yeah, cook up real, gotta man. get his I had to turn bread. that shit to my trap, bro. Like you, know what I mean, I'm riding around. I'm in state to state. I can't, you know. I'm not finna go to nobody and try to serve, sell them no nothing, nothing, nothing that's gonna get me locked up, man. Yeah. Look here, man. I got a hat. <laughs> I got ten different ones. I got five, six different I shirts. I got uh, uh, hoodies. I got <laughs> yeah, I mean, whatever, man. And if you pay that enough, I'm gonna go on and get it to you. I need mm. you to you. You don't even know. You just turned into walking promo for me. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. So now when they see that, they gonna go look it up and 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 and, and Google it. Mm. Yeah. Who who cook up? Who is uh, uh, about two or three of cook up favorite rappers who cook up like? Cook up don't you know you ain't really a fan, you, and I know you like rappers, but I ain't never heard you just be a fan. Who is cook up rappers who he's listening to who he like? It can be old or alive or dead. Man, I like man. Listen, bro, I'm, I, that Travis Scott nigga, bro. He's a Fuck geeker. I like Yo. him. He yeah, me and like him on the same okay. thing. So, okay. you know, shit, you know. Let me see. Let me see, man. I like Gunner, bro. Yeah, I, I, I fuck with Gunner. I, I, like like yeah, I like his good shit. I like his. I don't care what I talked say. about him. Yeah, yeah, you know I mean, I like the little nigga. You know what I mean, Duh. I don't care what. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, I don't look, like what they look. talk about you, man. man Thug you know Daddy, man. Thug Daddy said Gunner didn't do nothing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's his man, Daddy. Listen. <laughs> Just like I argued with one of my nephews, or one of my little nephews, my young ones, by six nine back then. Yeah. Okay. And he made me understand. <laughs> you trying to make his street shit 
what he rapping about. Yeah. I like his music. <laughs> yeah. That's what he kept like, telling yeah, me. Facts. I like his music. Separate. I don't it. got to separate that, nigga. I don't got it like that. I don't got it like that. But Gunner, I, I like his music, bro. Are you doing music with six nine and six nine for the right no. character? <laughs> no, I don't care. What you say, no. Gunner? I'm, I was listen. I'm gonna tell you this. I'm gonna put this out there. No, and Kodak, I fuck with Kodak, bro. Okay, but he sold his integrity. Mm. Is what I feel like. And I, I, I don't. You like, don't think don't, the money? So, so you can't separate the rap from not when you street. going when you bring and see they because they done it for some street shit. They done it to get street cred. Mm -hmm. So they needed somebody with some good street cred yeah. to buy. Yeah, you see what I'm saying. So Kodak should have turned down that money. Is what he should have turned saying. it down. He should have turned it down and talked about him. He would have made more than a million. Yeah. Mm, so how do you how do so cook up? This is a good question. So how do you separate the streets from music? If you saying like Kodak saying, I do music. Like this is what I get paid to do. And and this ain't no this to this to this 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 me. Okay. I gotta be a real nigga. Man, this and Pete. But it kid, you know what I mean? Quit listening to the bloggers and shit, all these podcasts. Quit listening to these podcasts, bro. If you quit listening to these podcasts, niggas who can't rap or they washed up and they done got, you know what I mean? I ain't saying anybody, but yeah. the podcast niggas is what's killing the music. Okay. Because a, a nigga who ain't done nothing is trying to make you stand up on some shit that, that he ain't going to do. You see what I'm saying? Okay, yeah. He asking you questions and shit. They ain't never been through nothing. nothing. Like us, but I yeah. know you what you oh, done been through. You see what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, you see yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. But uh, another motherfucker with the podcast is sitting on there. He asking you about your street credit. And he ain't done a motherfucking mm -hmm. thing. Or oh, he's sour. He ain't got no business even, even talking Boom, to you about that. Boom, that. That, that, that shouldn't even be his conversation. He should be telling you, ask you what you got your kids for Christmas and how many skateboards you done rolled on and do you know how to fix a bike? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, so even with the, we can talk about the Cat Williams situation. Okay. So is that telling what he did? Just with him going on there and spreading everybody's business, is that a form of telling what you think? No, because listen, this is what I want people to understand with this telling. <laughs> okay. Telling is. Telling. If that's the case, everybody done told, nigga. Your mama oh. told you that when you was a kid. Cause don't come in here telling tell yeah. on nobody. So you see what I'm saying? You didn't everybody done done that. But what he done is he like he puts out shit out there that already was out there. Yeah. yeah. He really. confirmed it. He confirmed, that's, he confirmed it. That's yeah. what he done. Yeah. He confirmed. He didn't tell. But he done that to the motherfuckers who was shitting on him. Mm. So for, they made him back to the little dog. He turned into the big dog again <laughs> on their ass overnight, bro. You yeah, see what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what I'm telling you about the internet. Yeah. It's it's like a fucked up hair. Like you don't know how it's going to split. Mm. You, can, you can get the good part of it or the bad part of it. That's why I tell people, once you get on this internet and you think you're going to beat me, your ass grass. Because right. the internet, to beat the internet, you can't have pride. And you can't be emotional. Facts. Because only people on the internet is looking for sympathy and shit, nigga. They looking for a motherfucker to, 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 to stroke their ego, rub their back, some shit like that, bro. You feel what I'm saying, homie? So, like, for real. And so, but now Charleston White. Charleston White, the police, bro. Like, he telling you, he he calling the people. That's telling. <laughs> That's yeah, he telling. Like, he telling, bro. Just That's saying. telling. Man. But, so that ain't a, a character is still if you telling that's you know what I mean? Cause you know how some people say he said, no, nah, it's just a character. See that I go back to that, listen, this this what I just what did you hear what I said? Quit the blogger niggas. If we didn't have these new podcasts and bloggers and shit for mm -hmm. no motherfucker to sit down and talk, he couldn't he couldn't have never done that. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't have never done that, bro. So that go back to your integrity again. Nine out of ten, these motherfuckers sitting down to talk to you to tell on yourself, bro. They done got you on the internet to tell on Look, yourself. For it to be interested, you see what I'm saying? I'm finna write this name down because I can't see it on live. 
<laughs> but I'm gonna write this name down. I saw somebody at your spot one day. <sighs> when? I saw somebody at your spot one day. They was doing they, music. It, no, they wasn't doing music. But, but they was <laughs> looking at me crazy. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, I keep on saying, who is this person? <laughs> and then I bumped somewhere else. I saw this person again. This person. Yeah. Okay. You see the person I just said? Yeah, yeah. Okay, this person. So, quote, unquote, for no, was she one of your little stat thoughts? I can't say the name, but Ooh. I just showed you the name. Because... Today. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, no, no. Okay. Hell no, hell no. Hell okay, no. okay, good. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. No, hell. But I'm just saying, they looked at me, you know what I mean? They, every time I go around, they always look at me crazy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Thinking I'm old. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And yeah, I'm. Yeah, nah, nah. Hell no. Nah. Okay, hell okay, nah, yeah, dude. yeah. Nah, I'll, nah. That's, that's, that's like. <laughs> okay. I'm from out east, Pete. Yeah, I know. I know. Uh, business. Okay, good. Yeah. Business. Good, yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. figured that. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying the person always look at me crazy. When I go around, like I'm on, and I be like, nah, I was just there. You know what nah, I'm saying? Nah, nah that's fam. Like, okay. that wasn't, you know what I mean? Like, like, listen, bro, that's one thing. I ain't on none of that. I with, if I, if I, 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 if I say I fuck with you, Facts. that ain't even crossing me. Now, if you do something sour, and then, then that's, it, 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 hey, that, uh, I'm gonna show you why they call me shy. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm saying. I can you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, Shy. And uh because I want to get to uh I want to get to a situation. I'm gonna show you another name in a minute. I get to the situation because they said it was it's just something fishy about this. But um how you and Shaq, man, how did relationship start and uh didn't he come down here? Shaq? Yeah, 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 yeah. We went we all, we all fuck with her. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> Check. Like, <laughs> I, that's my cousin. Yeah, okay. you know I mean, like, I can't. I can't no, really, some real shit, though. Yeah, like some real shit. Like, you know, I be, I, 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 I be trying to. We got mutual, mutual. You know what I mean? Where where he come from and where I come from, we got real, real like mutual, you know what I mean? And they put us together. You see what I'm saying? Like, you know, and they and he fuck with us, this fam, like, you know what I mean? Well, I'm just saying. Just Shout think, out to Shaq, just man. Think hey, about hey, it. hey, hey, big dude. Everybody can't mess with Shaq, dude. You know what I'm saying? Nah, like nah, I nah. think you be taking your relationships for granted sometimes, cook up. You be you know what I mean? You like saying, like, nigga, everybody can't mess with Shaq. Nah, they can't, but at the same time though, man. What made Shaq like cook up? Out of all people, cook up. <laughs> just, we we, we want to know. The people want to know. <laughs> the, the, the hey, people wanna, like, wanna uh, know. what is it about cook up that he, Shaquille he, O'Neal he, likes? He, he just like me, bro. <laughs> He 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 fucked up like when the cameras and shit go yeah. off. He's yeah. like, ooh, oh, bro. Okay. <laughs> he doing the same shit we do. Okay. He just got a lot of money. Yeah, you know what I mean? he doing the same shit we do. When the, the camera go out, everybody can be themselves, man. Boom, boom, boom. Here it is, man. Hey, relax, goddamn. You know what I mean? Yeah, shit, we, we messing with Shaq, yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. yeah, nah, this my guy, man. Have y'all ever talked about doing any kind of business or anything together? Yeah, cook up. Nah, with him I being bum down on them this year about some shit like that, but you know, I I, I really nah. I'm, like I'm we saying, always every time we, we every time we up. rock, we just rock. It's just like, you know what I mean? It's just rocking, you know what I mean? It's rocking. But no, on some real on some real, real talk shit, it'd be good for the for the city to cook up, you know what I mean? Just yeah. to got them and get some get something going with them. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. bring something to the city. Nah, that that hell yeah, that'll be straight though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But look to get him down here, you know what I mean? Real quick, what you cause, cause I, I want to ask you this question. This is a real question. Okay. Because I got to ask you what the people want to know. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Ask me what the people want Okay, I am going to ask you. I'm going to race that right there. Okay. But I'm going to put this right here. Okay. Can't say this name because I'd be in trouble. This motherfucker right here. You see that name right there? Huh. You see that name right there? Yeah. Okay. Now, the real issue with you and Buck is it over over her? 
Hell no. Um, cook up. Cook up. Uh -huh. I asked you that on some real. Get what I said. I have never, ever met, known Cook to be messed up over no chick. No, man. Hell, listen, bro. <laughs> homie. <laughs> I have never. Real spill, Real homie. Spill. Like, like, listen. It was never people, bro, we from out east, bro. It What's was never mean? no listen, homie. We in Atlanta. We down there. I ain't gonna put everybody's name. I'm talking okay. about some reputable people there. Facts. Like some real reputable people, bro. For real. No bullshit or nothing. Yeah. The punk run up on us, bruh, like a fan. You know, like, but whole time, dude knew who, knew who it was. You know, me being from Nashville, I laughed a lot. Yeah. Ha, 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 you know how I am. I'm like, damn, yeah. yeah, boom, all right. Didn't think nothing else about it, bruh. Ain't heard nothing that since then, and boom, boom, boom. Week or so later, go by, nigga, I'm coming back from tour. I'm coming from Houston, Texas, bro. Driving, we on the road, nigga. Yeah. I check my DM. The punk in my DM tell me <laughs> since you want to laugh, I got your homeboy right here, bro. It wasn't no extra shit or nothing. Man. This my nigga. I'm on the way back. We coming back. This was in the uh, uh, I'm on the tour with Wolf. Then yeah. I'm coming back. I'd hurry up, boom, 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 screenshotted it. I mean, screen recorded, you know, boom. Do what you do. Send it to dude. Man, what's up with this right here, man? Just being an east side nigga, not holding behind your back, asking you personally. Personally? Okay. Man, what's up with this? <laughs> <laughs> and you can't see the thing is, I'm your homie. Yeah. Like we we you with me damn near every day, you know what I mean? When I ain't taking care of my business, you you or you ain't taking care of your because business. Because you we, actually fucking with the nigga on some real shit. Real though. shit, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I mean? You can't tell me it's you, nigga. I seen I was with you when you bought the coat and I just was driving your car. You got your keys in your hand. So all that old other shit, it ain't me, it ain't me. You couldn't tell me that. Uh, yeah. This you right here. Fuck what the internet talking about. This you, homie. What's up with this? Boom. All right. He got some homies that don't like me. The niggas in the video. You yeah, know what? Yeah. You know, other punk nigga. Yeah. You know, the sucker. <laughs> yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? They get with that over there. You know, they don't really like him fucking with Cook Up anyway. But you yeah, know what I mean? You know. Uh, always some jealousy. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. So, all right. They got on that. So, you know, me, I get on the internet, you know, it's just us <laughs> bullshitting. You know, I ain't thinking it's going, you know what I mean? Do, do what I'm do. just burning just on you, nigga. talking back, really. Yeah, nigga, What's I'm saying? burning on talking you, back. nigga. Nigga, you done got caught with the damn boy. The fuck is wrong with you, David? That's all. And that went from there. See, it's like motherfucker call, I'm call, they, they like calling them David and shit, motherfucker. Not under, that's what we do every day anyway. Yeah. It was just the internet had never seen me do this to them. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So that's when it, you know what I mean, shot on off. You how, know many, I mean? how many times do you think y'all done ran into each other to like just do that, this whole situation like going on? You know what I mean? About a hundred times. But how personal was it for you though? Just the whole situation. Was it? It, it wasn't never really. Was it personal? Was it ever personal? It, it ain't. It wasn't never personal, personal to me. It wasn't never personal to me, bro. She was funny for real. Yeah. She was really just funny for real. Like I, I go back to like I'm saying, his homies wanted to go there with that. They 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 wanted to you know. It's me, P. I don't got yeah. no scars and no, shit. I don't got no, I don't, I don't got no smut on my name. You, you know been I mean? cooked up for forever, just and that I'm ain't, the same that ain't taking up for you because you, cause you exactly. here. Look, this why I respect you, cook up. I'm, I'm tell the you. same nigga since since if, we was goddamn in the damn wood or what if they grew up with us or something. You this know this I mean? why I respect cook up. When I was on vacation. And them niggas were putting smut on my name. As niggas in Nashville do. You know how it go. It's for everybody. 
But nigga, when Moon them came in there, Moon them said, nigga, cook up the only nigga telling niggas like P ain't doing no shit. You know what I'm saying? Like that. And and I told Lowe, I said, I got respect for you forever just for, you know what I mean? Because, you know, these niggas ain't standing up for no nigga, man. You know what I'm saying? This, this is, <laughs> hey. I don't know what they did or what you, you know what I mean? I know what you did for me. Facts. Well, definitely. And that's that on that. Uh, that, that we, oh, hey, hey, I don't got to, it, it, we from out east, you know what yeah. I mean? This, I, don't, I don't care what you say, cook up. You can, you can, you can, you can downplay this because you will downplay some stuff. When 50 put you on his page, nigga, how did you feel? I know you, I know you felt just like, nigga, you know what I mean? Just with, with, with what you doing. Bro, listen, to be honest, man, get one of the, I, look, bro, fucking with Buddy, man, I met so many motherfuckers and shit that's like, you know. Y'all all went up there to meet 50 at the time. Yeah, what we, happened up we there? We, what what really happened up there? What really happened up there, Cook Up? What was the, what was, why did y'all even go up there? Just to be honest. Why did y'all even go up there? Y'all don't know. No, nah, we not. We really, listen, they told me to ask you this. They were, This is stuff that they want to know. Not that I want to know. I want to know it, but they want to okay, know it. Okay, this is what happened. Seriously, why y'all go up this there? this is what happened, homie. We went up there for the G Union reunion, bro, right? Mm hmm Charlie P. Charlie P had brokered like a little deal, nigga. He was going to give us 500 to just do some, you know, get some cash real shit going down mm -hmm. here. You see what I'm saying? After the, you know, the G Union reunion had did it all right. You know, they yeah. had some songs and shit. You know what I mean? Okay. We all go up there. We stand at the man house for about a month or two, bro. You feel what I'm saying? We did a tour up there too, though. We did mm -hmm. a tour. You know, they did, the, you know, up there. That's all. Uh, DC, you know, we did about 10, 20 shows up there. I know y'all putting it down you like casual shit. Yeah. So, like, whatever we went up there, bro, to to broker the deal, bro. It's me, band play, mm -hmm. D Strap, D Tay, Lil Mac, yeah. and Buck, bro. And Charlie P was gonna get whatever cut out for broking the deal. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling them, I take whatever. Long as I can buy my way, I can get all the bread back yeah. or however this go. And give my little Cause you still like I'm putting my bread up. Yeah, and, <laughs> yeah. and we gonna go on about our business. Yeah. You know what I mean? All right, bro. You know we get up there, brother. Niggas send them back. You know they don't got no cake, so they can't stay. You know and mingle and shit too much longer. You see what I'm saying? All right, me, D. Tay, David. Charlie P. Stayed. Charlie P. had probably stayed up. I think he left and came back. You know what I mean? But uh, we stayed up there, bro. After after look, the man. We better counts and all this old shit to get shit going or whatever. Charlie had set up or whatever, bro. Then next thing I know, everything is just over with. But you, do you think Buck ever had any good intentions on what all was going nah, up there? No, nigga. He t and he turned down the 500, nigga, and took them 250. That's when he got in the hole. Nigga, we were coming back. That nigga was buying Gucci uh, 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 sheets and shit in the airport, what? nigga. Mm. Cut us out the deal. Then when we get back, boy, see, look, I'm going to say this on your podcast, nigga. This, this, exclusive. this right here going to get you up to the moon, nigga. <laughs> this exclusive. This real exclusive. Facts. The Canaan CD. Mm-hmm. The nigga, 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 nigga song. Nigga yeah, boosted, I know what that nigga. talking about. Band had done it. Boom. The nigga sold him that song, too, nigga, for like 50. Chump my nigga out of the bread, nigga. He know what he did. Tell him cook up there for all the real <laughs> business meetings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Then yeah. when we get up there, bro, 50 lay this thing down to us, nigga. 50 can get on there and quote me this, nigga. Facts. Tell a nigga, look, bro. Like, uh, I'm going to give y'all five shows, nigga. You know, if you buy like $10,000 of F and Vodka, this is when the F and Vodka and shit was going on. What's going on? Because Charlie P was in on that deal, okay. right? Okay, then. I'm okay. Gonna, you know, we all, look. Okay. You, you buy $10,000 from F and Vodka, the representative of that Vodka got to come to your club. Mm. 
just like, you know, if Avion or if Ciroc Anytime. did it, like the Bel Air, Rick Ross can You see what I'm saying? Yeah. All right. He give us five of them, bro. The first show we do, nigga, we make all the, for the five. I'm telling the man, listen, bro, we hustling. Well, we're going to get a man to 50, and we're going to go on all the rest of them as goddamn it free bread. Mm. Free bread, bro. Do you know the nigga didn't show up to now one of them? The nigga tried to sue us and everything, nigga, the nigga who was doing it, nigga. Wow. Man just kept on fucking up shit, nigga. All this is did. And then, look, hold up. This white, like, look, we come back. Boosie just getting out, bro. This man charged $150,000, $125,000 versus, nigga. We sitting out west, nigga. He put David on like a man. Mm. Took him up off hell. Why? You think? I don't know. I ain't got to, when I see him, I'm gonna ask him again. Put Rich Homie <laughs> Quan on there. I got the song with David on there rapping, nigga. Mm. Nigga can't tell me. Yeah, see, that's why I said, if they wanna know all the real shit, yeah. nigga gonna know all the, that sucker shit, what they talking about. Yeah. We talking about the business. Yeah. You see what I'm saying, homie? Like, that man fucked the nigga out of so much business, man. The nigga like, like, bruh. And this, this is just me and you. Like, I always tell my... Man, if this nigga was a business man and this cook up telling you, nigga, you don't get in no booth and say them raps, nigga, and let a little nigga come and say them and sign them in a 360, mm. nigga, and quit trying to steal the light from these niggas, man. Yeah. Fuck wrong with you, nigga. Is that what you think, like, what's really, like, kind of wrong with ass with niggas trying to be gatekeepers? Man, what? That's what's going on. That's what's going on, man. These niggas ain't never really had none of their own, bro. Mm. Already had cake, bro. But when you came in. Up. Okay, yeah. then. That's what I'm trying to tell <laughs> yeah, you. So yeah. the money and all that, it's just a, a hustle for me. You, you think 50 of them probably knew that you had... They bro, when I got it. up there, bro, listen, bro, I only seen David at nighttime, bro. Mm. Oh, we do, bro. So 50, 50 had to take a liking you just to even. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Again, why is everybody taking a like in the cook up, nigga? No, nah, bro, it's just real shit, shit bro. Yeah. It's just, you, if you're a real nigga, man, real nigga gonna rock with you, man. Yeah. Niggas, niggas done got the internet and opinions and shit, man, and shit, all that old shit. The internet gave a sucker nigga opinion. The nigga that couldn't come on the basketball court while we were hooping. Yeah, he got that He couldn't talk internet. to the gal. They gave him an opinion. Yeah, yeah. For real, homie. That's what they done. You know what I mean? So now everybody can speak up. So now the nigga whose opinion don't matter, once he make his statement, motherfuckers going off of his opinion. Yeah. And he don't even fucking matter. matter. Yeah. But just because it's on the internet, you know what I mean? They make him, if it catch a little trend. Exactly. Mm. So funny. do you think it would if 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 y'all would have done the right thing with whatever whatever fifty was trying to do was trying to do, do you think it would have really worked? Man, man, man got feel? 30 platinum plaques now. Damn. Shout out to band play. What is you talking about? What's band play? Uh, what's his work ethic? What what he doing that everybody else ain't doing? Man, my nigga make a thousand beats a day. I'm talking about to the point where I was sick of him. Get out of here, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Why did, again, here we go again. What made band play like Cook Up? Even though, you know, we I all, we I love believe, Cook Up. I believed in band, you know bro. What I'm we, listen, we bro, when I up. first met band, bro, 10, 12, 15 years ago, bro, I believed in my nigga, bro. I got band on songs rapping and everything. Dang. He was KG on the track. Yeah, they got put you out there. Yeah. Yeah, see, this cook up. I know the real. He was KG on the track then. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm, mm, yeah. mm. Bam, man. I believed in my nigga. I always told him, man, don't let no, you know what I mean? You can't just, you know what I mean? I ain't trying to take no advantage of no niggas or none of that shit. Homie, I ain't never come for that shit. Man, I'm looking at that shit like, okay. It is what it is, bro. It's music, bro. Yeah, you know I mean, if 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 we can take us to another place, let it do that. Yeah, I ain't gonna try to stop what it can do. You see what I'm saying? That's what's wrong with these niggas around here. Motherfucker scared of what it might do for them. You see what I'm saying? That's what me going. That's why I'm trying to show a motherfucker. Me, if I can go sit up on the on the stage with all the country white people, bro, and rap about selling dope and and, and and in my hood and shit and and get them to to like it if they don't uh uh, uh you see what i'm saying yeah. uh buy into what i got going on man hey 
but but for cook up just on some getting some some bread type of shit like what it look like really for real like you buck and star and the quantities and stuff really like coming together really trying to do some real shit on this rap shit can you see like something like that happen can you work with niggas you know what yeah. i'm saying but i wouldn't do no rapping with them bro like we can rap do the music but that'll just be something to you know yeah. show some like unity type, type shit, shit. Yeah. that ain't what a, what i really you know what i mean if we're gonna do that we need to get the business going yeah fact we need to find us some little niggas and and do from the ground with that yeah. You know what I mean? We just gonna use our name to do it. Yeah, facts. You see what I'm saying? Like, man, the shit is fucked up, man. Like, man, two hours down the road that way, niggas getting signed every other day, day man. Come on, Three man. hours down that road, niggas that way, getting, niggas getting- What's wrong with us, cook up? That was, um, you know what I mean? They, I just they respect you. your opinion. I just told you, if a nigga come from Memphis, you think he ain't already promised niggas in Memphis he gonna, what he going to do for him? So why could we ex expect him to do something for some people here? Yeah. So to, to start and fuck all the point, you know what I mean? I don't say nobody ain't nothing or the, yeah. the, the program directors or none of that shit. We ain't going to point no finger. Yeah. Put a motherfucker from Nashville in that spot. Right, yeah. And that, then that we can go from, from there. Yeah. Nah, they don't. They don't even got Not the old, old, but just like, but just know what's going on around here. Yeah, and push the music scene through that. Just like what what little baby say, the nigga who worked at the radio, nigga played this song on the radio, and they kept playing this song, and they fired him. He went back and gave that man a job. Mm. Now he one of the biggest artists. That's what I'm saying. We don't got nobody like that. It's to, to everybody around here, this shit, that's a job. I'm going to go in and do my eight hours and go home, nigga. That's all I'm going to do. And while I'm at my eight hours, I ain't even going to do nothing then. But, uh, but, but are the artists su supposed to support the artists? Like, if Cook Up, if Cook Up got motion around here, are the artists supposed to get behind Cook Up? You know what I'm saying? Like, no. if Cook Up got motion. No. No. Because... Every artist got their own artistry. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? I don't even like half of these niggas raps. Cause I don't, I'm 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 listening for authenticity. authenticity. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? If you who you say you is. Uh -huh. Yeah. But after I get to pass that part, now I'm trying to figure out what I can make off of you. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? Right. And then with me knowing you probably, and you probably a little hot nigga or something, a little nigga running around here in the stole low with your gun, packs on you, you see what I'm saying? And you're going to fuck up the money. Like, I'm going I'm to take you, I'm going to give y'all another thing. Give me a exclusive. <laughs> if you're last subscribed. Uh, another. And this, and this a family shit, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Like when we were young, like Chino. Nigga, we got China in the hood. You hear me? Yeah. Rapping his ass off. Most definitely. Chan crazy. Chan gonna go to jail and fuck up the money. Mm. But we got a nigga named All Star too. From around the corner though. Yeah. He ain't on that. Who we gonna invest in? We gonna invest in All Star. Okay then. That's what niggas ain't understand and shit like that, man. I don't give a fuck if it ain't your friends or family or none of that. It's business. Yeah, yeah. And people not understanding that. That's why niggas like Lil Uzi Vert and niggas like 6 9 a win. Because they going to listen yeah. to, to, to they get to wherever they then. Then once they get their nuts and they drop to the flow, they turn into that. You see what I'm saying? But, they go on to show their true colors. And the business, like you said, it's business. And if and if rap niggas and just niggas streetwise know that you don't handle your business in the rap, why ain't niggas coming to cook up for the information and to kind of get with cook up to do that shit right? Cause I I done saw you make money doing it. Yeah, but shit, cook up don't know everything, but cook up when point them in the right direction, direction or guide them in the right direction. But man, I ain't I ain't listen. Cause, cause let me tell you something, Pete. And I want to tell all these young niggas this, man. Man, to be a rapper, it costs money, homie. Man. Well, I'm, my hands is is up to them. You, I know it you costs gotta, money. You got to either be willing to put your last in you or have you an angel investor and just owe somebody. 
You need an angel investor. <laughs> Cook yeah. can be an angel investor. <laughs> <laughs> Who, when Cook up gonna start angel investing in man, these you niggas? You don't know. I, hey, man, listen, man, a lot of shit around here is angel invested. <laughs> you know okay. what I mean? We just, it look good. You yeah. know what I mean? Shit, but hey, man, but, but man, for real. Like, that shit, that's what, listen, homie, that's all of the, man, listen, man, like that nigga said, Cat Williams said, Kevin Hart, bro. That's a plant. That's a plant. So you don't think nigga like uh <laughs> niggas is plant nigga. They <laughs> I ain't gonna say no names. I don't finna say some names. But, but niggas is planted, planted, bro. Like niggas is planted, bro. You don't think these niggas planting they mirrors, nigga, niggas planting these people right there, man. Putting these niggas around certain niggas, man. Come on, man, nigga just pop out. And he got it. Then they giving you some street cred. I'm gonna tell you how you a. Uh, I'm gonna tell you how you a real industry right wise. You know I know niggas fuck with you, but um, I swear Vizo ain't fucking with too many niggas again. What made him fuck with Cook Hawk? Bro, we street niggas, man. And shout out to Viz, man. Oh, I, I get what I tell niggas. <laughs> I, I can't. I ain't gonna give all of me, but. Man, Viz a real nigga, bro. I bet, Viz man. Viz on can, a yeah. real nigga. On me. Like, I'm talking about stand up, man. I salute that nigga, man. I ain't even bored. All these plugs coming through band play, man. What's going on, Cook Up? Nah, nah. Where all these niggas coming from just to mess with Cook Up? We, we want to know. No, nah, like, like, you. Like, it just come together. It be like street shit. Band get me in there. Up. Band, look, bro, bro. That's, that's you know what I mean? Yeah, shit, hey. I been with, I fuck with band. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, he but, ain't answer my DM by coming on this podcast, but I fuck with him though. Maybe you can tell him something. Talk to this sticker, <laughs> man. Tell this sticker, he don't dodge no DM for me, man. Hey, you know what I mean? The hell wrong with you. I'm, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm a fan, though. I'm a fan. I'm a I'm a fan of band, though, man. Band done, band done treated cook up and a couple of niggas I know right. You know what I'm saying? Nah, band, so, listen, man, band the real And nigga. you don't care who he deal with. He got he got song with Buck, he got song nah, with Lito. Listen, bro. Yeah. Listen, my man, listen, man. We ain't listen. I let a nigga know, man, if a nigga ain't realized right now about me, man, it's about the money, man. Yeah. I can't I can't take my street cred to the bank, bro. <laughs> Val, listen, I just told a motherfucker I'm all out of digital money. Hey. All the people who want money or asking and begging, they want digital money. They, they don't want that cash. And they don't want no cash. They don't want that you tell a nigga money. come and get the cash, nigga. He he can't find a ride. <laughs> hey, how you know Byron doing, man? Man, she doing all right. You know what yeah, She's yeah, still man. giving the church people her money and stuff. Yeah, you, you know, Cook gonna talk about his mom and yeah, everything. Yeah, and she gets still giving the pastor yeah, her money and stuff. Do, man. This shit, man. Come on, man. We from the project, man. I just told a nigga, man. We from, well, the insurance man walked around door to door with the folder in his hand, man, getting everybody. <laughs> Mama, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> niggas still got policies they don't even know about, no. nigga, from the pride, nigga. <laughs> yeah, man. Mm. You know what I mean? But like I said, like, what you think, Cook Up, going forward, Cook Up, if everybody trying to come together and put this shit together, like, what you, what, what part is Cook Up playing in bringing this shit together? Man, I'm playing whatever role I need to play, man. Get the bag. At the end of the day, I've been I've been seeing them, they misrepresenting us right now, so yeah. I'm, I'm coming back to talk shit. Yeah, I'm <laughs> professional hell. shit talker. Give me, give man? me your, give me, give me your five Cashville legends. Cook up, give me cook up five Cashville legends who he can stand on. What you mean, like Just in the music? Rap in the music business. In the music of Nashville, cook up five cash real legends. Dub C. Okay. Greenway. Okay. His name that came up a lot. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, You're a rapper. It should be easy. Big Pistol. Okay. Number three. Cool Daddy, I fuck with Cool Number Daddy. Four. And let me see who else. Let me see. I'm gonna tell you a little a legend that they don't ever talk about, but was the hardest shit around here, man. And I'm gonna talk about because I know him. I know <laughs> Lil Myron, nigga. What's Lil Myron? Get it how you live. See, nobody don't even remember that man. He was the hardest shit around here. 
He was the first nigga I ever knew that did his beats, rap, the young nigga. Everything. Lil Myra, nigga, you see, though, you, you probably don't know because y'all didn't do music and shit we back did, then. Yeah, but we, I was just around all the, you know, the yeah. people. But, yeah, Lil Myra, bro, that's one of the cats. I'm going to get Lil Myra. Mm-hmm. He fucked up right now, though. He crazy and shit <laughs> now, but, <laughs> but you, you know, you, yeah, you, I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean. Yeah, yeah, I mean. But, yeah, get it how you live, man. That was a get it how you live entertainment, bro. Mm, mm, mm. I all them was with well you know they the first one did you know Manny Fresh and shit with Hot Boys and shit BG them and all them used to be down here that's who they yeah. used to be with bro Lamar. you know little Jimmy and them used to have us a nigga when I was kids and shit sent Ted them and shit you know when I was young know I mean we were young and shit you know what I mean who, who cook up like who do cook up like to do music with in Nashville rap wise who you who you like to collide with on music? I do with the same motherfucker that you know. She is star. Facts. Trapper Man deal. Mm, D Strap. Shout out Trapper Man. Shout out to D Strap. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, G Shive, you know what I mean? You know, all you know, my nigga but shit. I ain't I ain't really got too many, you know. See for us, you know what I mean? And Wolf though. Yeah. I like doing it with Yellow Wolf, bro, because it's, it's it's like a competition when we get in there. Like, you know what I mean? Is it cool that Yellow Wolf and Buck is best friends now? Yeah, that's cool. I'm just, I'm just asking. I don't care. Cool. I know you don't care. I'm just. See what people never understood, bro. Listen, bro. We all would. Listen, when I signed to them, they were still under shaded. Yeah. I know. All that was at the same thing. Slum American was shaded. G Unit was shaded. So whichever way you went, left or right, it was the same thing. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? I getting paid. I finna. I gotta get get my check off of that, <laughs> sh- that last shady album. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So you happy with it? I, I be you? trying to tell people, man, what what you don't know <laughs> won't hurt you. You know what I mean? See, they looking at it as all oh, you on there. No, I ain't hating on no man. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Nigga, and you ain't was, mad at nobody. Exactly. Are you? Okay. People need to understand, look, I was there to get a check off of him, too. Yeah. That's all people not understand. Motherfucker ain't coming to you. I ain't, I ain't in no music with no motherfucker for us to be friends, nigga. No, facts. No, definitely. We cool because where we come from is, you know, it's love. Yeah. But this shit is business, homie. Yeah. You know what I mean? And if you continuously fucking up the business, we not friends. Facts. To, to nobody, that ain't that ain't to a certain person. person that's to, uh, that's to that's anybody. To anybody. Yeah, hey, that ain't that, that, that ain't that certain person. To, you know what I mean? Like what what what? Motherfuckers be getting this shit all confused, man. You know what I mean? Like 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 like. That's why it's so easy. That's why these niggas' houses shit get double back and broke into and all that old shit. They got too many friends. <laughs> you know what I mean? You, you just anybody friend. Last week I seen you with these niggas. Then last week I seen you with these niggas. Last week I, the week before that you were with these. You man, anybody you friend. You anybody friend. And yeah. that's what happened to dude though. Yeah. See? He was just in too many crews. Yeah, facts. You see what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Instead of just standing on, listen man, you could trace me back to 30, 40 years ago, man. 30, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm with the same niggas, bro. Off the top. You, you, you I'm talking about the exact same. The exact same <laughs> niggas, bro. Yeah. Half of these niggas don't got that, bro. Like you, you, you everywhere. You, you can't even. You see what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's no way you can. You know what I mean? You can prosper with no shit like that, bro. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And they can, um, they can try to take cook up credit all they want to, but cook up like. I always told you you were smart. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cook up. They don't. They don't know. Cook up is slick. Smart. <laughs> hey, I remember, no. I remember the Veek. They what don't they even mean? know nothing about the start. The Veek, you know what I'm saying? They think he's slow, you know what I'm saying? So what made you hop into like real estate after all that shit? What could make Cook Up say, I'm just going to go buy some houses and shit? Man, guess what? My baby mama. <laughs> baby mama. Ooh. Baby mama, she, 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 she robbed me. From the daycare. <laughs> no, shit, I, no, no, okay, we ain't gonna no, talk no, about yeah, it. I don't want to get in trouble. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, houses and shit. She, she, nigga had, nigga had a role. Yeah. As a young nigga, you know, you know, so she, you know, it's always gonna be gas, you know what I mean? Like, you know, I, I, st- I ain't tripping but on that. But you never had that. She got yeah, the baby. Yeah, you know I, what I'm saying? We, 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 me and her laugh about that shit <laughs> to the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we you good. still in the sound. Yeah, yeah, but I'm y'all good. <laughs> but yeah, you know, hey, hey, hey. 
you know, shit, it's, shit go like that. that but it's it's like, you know, she put me on to some extra shit. Like, you yeah. know, like, you know, go, you know what I mean? Your money don't got to be in the shoebox all the time, man. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You can go do this with it. You can go do that with it, you know what I mean? So, you know, it, it just, you know, after that, it, it it grew some fire under my ass, you know what I mean? Yeah. I be trying to let these niggas know, you go lose four, five hundred in a, in a walk. Yeah. You know what I mean? I ain't talking about no dollars, neither, you know what I mean? I ain't talking about nothing. I ain't talking about four, five thousand. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> yeah, shit, but you know, hey, but you know. And so cook up, invest in property, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, 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 And that's yeah. what I'm saying, cook up, man, you really on some real nigga shit. You really got a lot of stuff to teach these folks. They just think you just play because sick of you Sunday and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But nah, if a nah, mother really talk to you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, nah, nah. The sick of you Sunday just for me, just fucking with people, bro. I'm from, why we from out east, P? Man, I kind of tell, I explain that to people. I'm from East Nashville, bro. I don't give a fuck if your people bought you both pair of Jordans, Ed. The black and the white ones when they came out when you were little and the jogging suit. Nigga, we still burn on you. <laughs> Nigga, we don't give a fuck you who can be you the is. cleanest thing out there. <laughs> and we God, gonna find something. Man, something to wrong get with you. you. <laughs> Nigga, man. Nigga. Going on. Man, look, look, man. Y'all know I had to have my dog cook up here, man. Cook up, man. Get these people some motivation, man. For the 2024, man. So they can have some to leave, man. Oh it man, okay. Listen, man. listen, man. Look here, professional shit talker on the way. I ain't a rapper. I'm an unrapper. Yeah, you know I mean. I don't read about I call you when I get it still to this motherfucking day, <laughs> nigga. Fuck yeah. you talking about. <laughs> yeah, nigga, you know what I mean? But, yeah, if you alive, subscribe, goddamn it, you know what I mean? You know what it is, man. Shay life in this motherfucker, man. I appreciate P for having me, man. And yeah, man, be looking for me, man. It's finna go down. You know what I mean? It's That's finna right, go down. Man. Look, man, y'all know. Hey, it. and y'all need to look one more thing, man. Tag that Quantic Cash, nigga, <laughs> and that I am ham, nigga, <laughs> and tell them. Cook up Bernie Mac, goddamn it. It's time for these movies, goddamn it. <laughs> it's you time hear for me? these movies. Hell cook yeah. Up. Cook up Bernie Mac, goddamn it. Yeah, I mean, kick ass. Hey, <laughs> it's time for these movies, man. Look, shout out to all my Cash Field fans. Y'all know I had to have Cook up. Y'all be mad about Cook up because y'all can't get him. I <laughs> <laughs> if yeah. you're alive, subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.